So, right, yeah, look, my old pal, Meg <laughs> Oliver. Right? This is uh, a good man. We, we, we yeah. started this four years ago. Yeah, I got yeah. A, a phone call from John because I'd put my face in the public arena. John didn't know where to go. No, I was so, lost. Yeah, and I was still lost, but a little bit wiser. And we have supported each other as a listening yeah, ear, really. Yeah. But John is a very brave person. Um, um, I thought he was going to really lose, lose yeah, his Yeah, so life. did I. I thought he was going <laughs> to lose his life and his livelihood, and, but he stuck with it. And but, but what I want to say to the public is that we're getting criticism from people <laughs> saying because they're police officers, they're disingenuous, maybe they're sinful. We're doing this for the victims and survivors of abuse, and we've both suffered so badly throughout this. And we have, I mean, our losses have been monumental, but yeah, we're here but it, still. It's worthwhile it because is worthwhile, yeah. um, I feel that we're talking out for people who don't have a voice, make a difference. And I wish I didn't know what I now know, no. but I do. And I can't put it back in the bag. And to think that I, there are so many good, honest, honourable police officers like John and I doing their job day to day, feeling that we're doing the right thing. The people at the top of those organisations are more on. interested in covering up yeah, corruption, yeah, yeah, in getting a, a big salary and yeah. a big pension. And even when people speak the truth and expose the corruption, they shoot the messenger. Well, they destroy and him. We're trying to, we're trying to make a difference, and we're trying to pull together so that nobody else has to go through what we've been no, through. No, no, no. It has to stop. Um, and, and if we're getting it, the poor victims get nothing. They get nothing, they get denigrated and they get thrown away. Their, their lives are destroyed. They are destroyed, yeah. Um, and, you know, they were written off for so many years as, you know, make, particularly victims of abuse, making a lifestyle choice. They are bad children, they are bad people. Yeah. They're not bad. Liars. They were vulnerable, they needed protecting. They needed help, yeah. Um, and that's what the police and social services are there for. So um, we are trying to... Um, be heard. Well, for, and put, for put an victims, end to this for yeah. the victims. We're doing this yeah. for the victims, and there has yeah. been comments that we're doing it for self-interest. Oh. There's not one of us have done it. We have suffered so badly. We would never do that. We're we're here for you, for the victims. We're here to put an end to this. Yeah. We're, we're reaching out to other police officers. Come forward. Drop the fear and join us. And I'm saying to chief constables, if you know about this, stop doing it. Please stop doing it. It's wrong. The public don't want you doing it, and you shouldn't be doing it. It's illegal. Here, here. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Bye-bye.